Hey guys, it's Baden. Welcome back to another video. Today we are playing part 29 of Let's Play The Sims 2 Newson Family. Very, very excited to get into this video. Today we're going to be playing in Garrett and Cherry's household with little Leroy. So, so exciting. We've obviously moved them in in the previous part um, and we want to make sure that their house is all set up. We're ready for them to go um, so we can get started. So we want to try and furnish this house. Yeah, they're both level 10 in their careers, which is amazing. I think in this part, obviously, the end goal for this family is I want them to get engaged, get married. Um, I don't know. I I just, I want to try and mix it up a little bit. Like, I don't know. I have a feeling we in one of the kids in the Newsom clan, I'm pretty sure, yeah, Gabriella had a baby before she was married, which is nothing wrong with that. I just like to mix it up and like show off different ways into like, you know, parenthood and like, you know, marriage and all that fun stuff. Anyway, I think we also had someone go into their labor at like their wedding was a bit of fun. So I don't know, maybe we'll see if they want to get engaged and then maybe early stages of pregnancy for the wedding. Who knows? A bit of fun. We'll mix it up. But anyway, we'll get, we'll get straight into it. We'll jump in. Um, oh, I want to, can this dog like not be here right now? Cause he's literally in the way. Um, but I want to just finish the house and make it look pretty. They've got 25 grand, you know, got a bit of dosh. Um, oh, I don't know. Did that just like glitch out the dog? I don't know what happened there, but, um, you don't work again until 2 AM and then you don't work again for a few more days. Um, one thing I've also recently discovered is that some careers, you really don't get much money in the top levels of the career. So one of those is the medicine career and one of them is the slacker career. So both these Sims are kind of stuffed in a sense. Um, so we'll see how we go money wise. If we're struggling with money, we might see if we want to potentially change careers, especially for cherry. Um, obviously anything's possible and, but I think it might be a bit ch more challenging for her to obviously, you know, have kids when she's working 10 PM to 2 AM, um, Friday, Sunday, Sunday. I don't know. It's not that hard. I mean, sorry. That sound, that came out wrong, but like, it's not that many days is what I'm I meant to say. Sorry. And it's not long hours, but like it's tough hours, like working 10 PM to 2 AM. That's going to whack your sleep pattern all over. So we might think about a potential different career. I was going to say, what does her lifetime want? It's to be a captain here, which is also another bad paying job. So yay, we'll figure it out. Um, I ended up Googling like the salaries of all the careers and, and there's like a website. Um, if you're interested, I can maybe link it down below. If I remember, I probably won't because it's 2 AM right now. And I'm pre filming some videos because I'm going on holidays. Um, I only found out about a holiday today. So anyway, I get to go on a holiday. So shut up, Aiden. It's literally fine. Did you piss yourself, Cherry? No, she didn't. I'm just joking. I think that there must've been raining, but anyway, let's remove some of the furniture that we don't need and we'll start making this house feel like more of a home. Um, I won't delete the kitchen just yet because you never know how much like, you know, money we'll end up needing, but I always like to not skimp on the essentials. As you know, in all of my videos, I love to make sure they've got a really good bed um, and a really good um, like TV because yeah, you do not want to skimp on that because it makes your gameplay hella difficult. Um, all right, let's get going, get this kind of different bed. I always pick the same bed. So I'm always picking the one that goes with this one, the Glamour life one. So we'll do something a bit different, you know, we'll mix it up. We'll get a dresser to go with it. Um, an armoire or whatever they call them these days. Um, let's just do it there. I feel like that's cute. I don't really think we need much else in the bedroom. I think we'll maybe get some lamps just to make it feel a little bit more homey for them. Homey. Sorry. Every time I say that, I like think of the Simpsons and Marge is like, homey. Anyway, sorry. I don't know why I'm being silly and goofy. I'm just waiting for, I'm also waiting for my fake tan to dry. I want to do another coat because I'm going to going up North. And like, if you're in the Southern hemisphere, North is hotter. So I want to be all like tanned and like, yeah, slay. And also, I mean, I tan all the time, so it's not really that much of a change. Green and blue does not go. I don't know why I placed that. Um, why is picking a lamp that difficult? Um, let's just, oh my God, let's just go with, oh, that's stunning. Beautiful. It really goes. I love that. Um, we actually don't have access to the outdoor area, which I don't quite like because I want to make a nice, ni nice outdoor area. I think that's always lovely. So oh, they have a single door. I have a thing with single doors in the Sims because like the Sims just get stuck. Like it's actually, <laughs> it's not funny. Um, it's actually really annoying. So yeah, I think that, do I want to change that around? Um, yeah, I do. <laughs> sorry, sorry, not sorry, but um, yeah. Maybe we'll, we'll, we'll change. Oh, I guess we'll get a nice little bay window-esque kind of vibes. Oh, oh, I've moved objects on. Oh, shite. Let's remove that just before I... F oh, my God. 
I have capsule con as well. What is going on? There we go. All right, let's fix that up. Get rid of the cheat window. Get rid of the cheat window. Thank you. And then let's fix this up. Um, I think this is cute. Something a bit diff. Maybe we could plant some more flowers and like frame the path. I don't know. It makes it more of a grand entrance. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Um, let's pick a cute grand front door. Oh, this is nice. I also am a... I'm a realist sometimes. I don't know what that means, but like I'm realistically having a glass front door is a safety issue. Um, I've heard a lot of people say, so you wouldn't want to have that, but it's the Sims. So we'll, we'll just live vicariously. We'll live on the edge, I guess. <laughs> All right. Why am I being weird? Um, let's fence this place in as well, because I do think that that is handy. Um, defense is, and I also want to move these trees. Oh, we've got little like little dirt patches. Well, we need to move objects on because I do want to get a garage. We're going to set them up for success in terms of we're going to give them all that they need. Um, and then, you know, if we can't afford it, we can't afford it. We'll worry about it later. All right. Let's get a garage in. Beautiful. Maybe we'll do a slightly bigger garage. Maybe we could do some, um, I don't know. Let's do, let's do this. Oh, it's not quite big enough. That's a bit annoying. Um, that's okay. We'll do that. Um, oh, these bricks like unintentionally kind of match, which is cute. Anyway, um, yeah, just that way we can have some little exercise equipment at the back there. I don't know if they, if they ever, if they ever feel the need. Um, oh, let's turn off move objects. Thank you. Um, what am I doing? Okay. There we go. Move objects off Soleil. Oh my God. So speedy with the keyboard. We, <laughs> we love it. Um, let's just get some windows. Cause I always forget to put windows in the garage. And I mean, like, Realistically, I feel like you wouldn't have heaps of windows because it's like just for like a, a, a vehicle. But um, I don't know. I think it's nice. I don't know. Maybe we'll say they repurpose that door. No, but like that's an internal door. I don't know why they put that there. Let's get um this one. Oh, that really doesn't go. I don't know why I wanted to do that. Let's get the oh, beautiful, stunning. It really goes. I love it. All right, let's get some lighting up in here. Some of these rooms don't have lights, which is interesting. All right, they've all got lighting downstairs. What about what about this bedroom? There's no lighting in here. And there's also only like one light. Oh, whatever, we'll put another one. All right, I want to get a fence. How have we spent 10 grand? I guess the bed was pretty expensive, but still 10 G. Jesus. Um, okay, let's do cute little fancy poo. Um, let's do... Oh, okay. I don't know why I tried to put that into a window. That's really random. Yeah, that's nice. Um, okay. Whoopsie. Did it again. Let's get some fencing for Leroy to, oh, I was going to say for him to run around, but he's an elder. So that's right. For the kids to run around. Be nice. They've got a huge backyard. I really like this. I've actually not really done much gameplay in the, this house before. So it'll be interesting to see what the gameplay is like. Like sometimes some layouts of houses are just like, you know, absolutely mint. And then other ones, it's a bit of a nightmare. So hopefully it's fine, but. Oh, 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 I have an idea. Oh, you like, sorry. <laughs> Do you like my idea? I like it. I think it's cool. Okay. That way we've got a little bit of, oh, I was gonna say I can't place that, but I figured it out. Oh, that looks funky. Why don't we do. Okay. I have an even better idea. Let's make it a double wide, double, double width. There we go. And then we'll just get a double, um, oh, the puddles in the way. Oh, it's fine. I'll fix it later. Um, I don't know. Do we want any paving out here? I feel like we'd have like maybe a little bit of cheeky paving, maybe just like a cute little kind of like deck esque area. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> We're in a really silly, goofy mood. Do we want to make the downstairs of this house a little bit more open plan? What are we thinking? I think that it's a little bit enclosed for my liking. Um, I don't mind the idea of having this kind of separate entry and then having maybe opening up this wall, I think is what it needs to, what needs to happen in this space. But then this is really weird. That is really weird actually in general. Um, I don't know why that wall is like that. Um, chow. Anyway, no, actually I'm going to fix it. I don't like it. Let's yeah, change it up. It, I guess it unfortunately does remove a little bit of the, um, you know, interest, you know, a bit of the uniqueness of the build, but it's, 
I think it's fine because it's really just a bit um of an eyesore. We just wrecked the roofing. Oh no, we're fine. Okay, I am going to not auto roof. Let's just get a basic little roof tool here. Place that. Stunning. We'll get some painting on there. Amazing. Really wish this door here was in line with the window, but you can't always get what you want in life. Um, so that's fine. Okay. Yeah, that's nice. I'm pretty happy with that. I kind of wish these stairs faced the other way. Is that going to be like a big... Oh, oh no, it's fine. It's fine. Because that... Okay, well, I'll leave it. I'll leave it. I'll leave it. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> I'm just really being really indecisive, guys. Um, No, yeah. Okay, I'm happy with the layout. I think that we'd make, yeah, this kind of like an intimate... Um, I want to say intimate, it's literally open plan, but like a little like lounge area this can be dining and we'll keep it pretty much the same and then we could kind of have some study-esque kind of items in this back corner um yeah i just realized we don't have an ensuite which is kind of annoying we could potentially extend along this front part of the house because yeah this is quite cramped and um I don't know how I feel about it. Like it's a little bit too cramped for my liking. I really cannot stand in the Sims when the landings are really tiny. Um, so yeah, I don't think that that's going to work out. Let's change it up a bit. Let's get, oh, I have an idea. Let's get a nice big daddy bathroom here. And like we can kind of mimic what's going on. Oh, not quite mimic what's going on. There we go. Um, and then I kind of want to extend... No, I reckon we can fit another bedroom up here, honestly. I really do. It's really poorly laid out. I think that we also could potentially make this a full bathroom down here um, because then we gain a bit of space upstairs, which is kind of what I, what I want. Yeah, let's make that a full bathroom. And then let's... Why? What's going on back here? I guess that makes sense, but, like, it also... Is a bit limiting in terms of the space here. I don't know. It's kind of annoying. Do I want to just extend? Do we want to just extend it fully? Potentially. Yes. All right. Let's remove a lot of the internal walls and start fresh because I'm not happy. Not happy, chappy. Not a happy, chappy. All right. Let's redo. Actually, I didn't mind the carpet. I'll just keep a little patch of it down there because I'm not going to be able to find that in the catalog. Um, sweet. Okay. So we've got a little bit more space now. I definitely want to have a really nice big, oh, whoops. Forgot about this. Got even more space. Oh, even more space. We love it. Um, I definitely want to kind of just keep, oh, this is just such a nightmare of a space to work with. Oh my God. I just don't like having really narrow, like it's not too bad now. I think that it makes a little bit more sense, but then how am I going to fit a bedroom up here? Like seriously. Um, oh, far out. I really am not happy with the layout. Maybe we need to move the stairs. I think that's the problem. I think the stairs are just in a really horrendous spot. Um, oh, I have an idea. I have an idea. I have an idea. I'm thinking out loud. Oh, actually, I want to keep one little strand of that out here. I don't know what I'm, I'm just... I like what they've done with the space. Um, let's move the staircase over one. So, is this going to work? I actually don't. Staircases are really annoying in The Sims 2. Oh, uh, do I need to go? I don't know what I'm doing. Is this door in the way? Is that the issue? Um, do I need to, like... Oh, wait, <laughs> that's way too much. One, two, three, four. Do I need to like do this? Can't play step Y, baby girl. What is wrong? What is the issue? What's down here that's blocking you? Nothing. So just place it. Like it's not that challenging. Do I need to place one of these? Oh, I have to place one of these. I don't like these staircases. I don't know. They're just not the vibes. Because see, like you can't remove the banister and it like cuts into everything. Or we could do a spirally spirally staircase. Maybe we could do a spiral. What do we reckon? And maybe that could create a little bit more space. I don't know why I'm talking 
like this. Yeah, that could make that could make more sense actually. We'll have a spiral staircase. Okay. Oh, and it actually goes with the um the railing actually kind of goes. Kind of goes. Teams with the theme as they say. All right, there we go. Nice. All right, cute. Let's work on the bedroom layout now. Because I'm not happy. All right, we've got way more space now. I feel like we could literally just be like bang, bedroom. Is that too big though? That's a generous bedroom. That's very generous actually. Um, I don't know. It's so hard. Like I don't, but then like that's too, a little bit too small. Do we think? Do we think? What do we think guys? That's a very generous bedroom. Like that's um, just, let's just have big bedrooms, I guess. Um, we could even fit another, we could actually, um, we could fit a bathroom up here. We've actually created quite a lot of space. Um, hmm. That creates a problem there because that's very narrow. So maybe we'll do, what about we do a funky room? What about we do a funky room, a funky space? I feel like that's pretty funky. Um, we could even like, I don't know. We could, it could be like really funky. We could do this, but then what's this? That's really like not in, you know? No, nah, it's just a little bit too crammed, especially, oh, it's only like one little tile there. Like that's going to create some problems. Why is this so challenging guys? I'm so sorry. I'm going to fix this layout. I'm going to cut give me a sec. Okay. What do we think about this? So I changed this to the master bedroom, this to an ensuite, and this to two bedrooms. And then this is just very spacious. So like you could even potentially put in like a main bathroom here or like, I don't know, it might need to be a little bit bigger, but yeah, like, I don't know, that could potentially work. Um, and then I don't know, that could stay just a little WC powder room kind of vibes. Um, yeah, maybe, maybe we'll just do that. I feel like I've chopped and changed so many of these walls. I feel like I need some money back. I actually, I'm not even joking. I'm going to give myself a little bit more money just because like I've changed, I've literally been so indecisive about this layout. Um, I'll give myself 10 grand because I, you lose money when you like remove, chop and change all the rooms. Okay. Let's fix the lighting. Cause the lighting's just a bit all over the place now that we've changed all these rooms around. Um, okay. Cute. I don't mind this. And then this person here, like this kid will get like a really nice big room and we can, oh, I've got to fix the windows now that we've changed. Oh my God. We've changed so much of the house around. Okay. Let's get some nice light, natural light in there. Uh, we've got a nice bathroom there. I, I don't really mind having some kind of big windows. Like, cause it's upstairs. Like no one's going to look. I hope not. All right, perfect. And then honestly, like this room can just be flooded in natural light. And then maybe this one can have, oh, it's got a balcony here actually. But do you want like a balcony looking out to like your parents' balcony? I don't know. I don't mind. I think it's fine. And then, I don't know, this is a cute little nook there. Or is that a bit fugly? I actually haven't made my mind up. Um, all right, let's fix up the painting. This is a pretty sizable house now. Yeah. So, um, the parents are definitely going to have to find a new job because we've really just, um, decided that we're going to, you know, have a crazy fendangled house. Um, let's just make this roof a little bit smaller. I can't stand how pitched the roofs are in this game. All right, let's get some painting. Um, uh, I don't know. Do we just, oh, yellow. Oh, oh. Ew, sorry, that's actually disgusting. Ew, what was that? Oh, I've never, never known what that was. All right, all right, cool. I'm happy with that. And let's paint all of the rooms up here in that color. Just get a bit of continuity going in the house, you know? Bit of same, same. All right, perfect. And we need to finalize some doors as well. So we'll pick some doors that we like. And we'll use them throughout the whole house. Um, all right, I'm happy with those as the tiling. Um, let's redo the tiling down here too. And then we need to pick some flooring for the bathrooms. That's going to be throughout the whole house. Um, I don't know. Um, I think there's some, oh, what about these little speckle tiles with a little diamondy thing in the middle? That's nice. 
Okay, let's get some cute doors. All right, let's pick a nice door for this house. I feel like I don't really mind going. Is that wood or is that? I'm sorry. I'm actually. I'm. I'm actually not kidding. I'm col. I'm very colorblind. I think that's a bit green. I kind of thought that was giving wood vibes, but I might be mistaken. Um, let's just do. Yeah, maybe we'll do a walnut door. Mix it up. Something a bit diff, you know. Um, yeah, it's got to open that way, and then maybe we'll get their door here. Oh, do we want it in line? Probably don't need the doors to be in line. So we might change that. Um, that door cannot open that way. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. I don't know what happened there. I think I just changed that around. Um, this door needs to open the other way. Changing the way the doors open in this game is really, it's actually not even funny how annoying it is. Like, why is it so challenging? It's, oh, it's because I need to like get it to go here. And then, oh my God. Okay. Yeah, that's what I meant to do, right? There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Um, okay, let's do that. Even though I don't like how close those doors are, but I don't want the door to be too close to the landing there. All right, we need to get the door downstairs too. Oh no, we already did the downstairs. Slay. Okay. Um, I think I want to make this all the same. Yeah, much nicer. All right, we only have four grand. Oh my God, this is really sad. That's okay. So we need to obviously need to prioritize a few things. We need to make sure that we get um, like a shower and everything in. I also really need to upgrade the TV. We don't quite have the money. So what's our priority going to be? We'll leave the TV. Um, let's get some bathroom. Oh my God, what's going on with the wallpaper here? Something didn't quite work there. I feel like I've, let me know if I've missed any bits of wall because like we changed around so much of the um, layout that the flooring's all messed up now. Let's do a cute little, um, I don't know, what's the best way to, what is the best way to do this bathroom? I think we need to just do toilet and then like just a basin and it's just, you walk along, it's like a galley style. Um, but I do want to pick a cute, uh, bench top that we might use in the whole house. I really want to do kind of want to do this in this house just for something different, but it's really expensive. It's like nearly $800 for that. Okay. We're really getting low on the money now. So I think we're going to change up their careers. Um, yeah, we're going to do that like right now. Let me just pull up this website and pick. Okay. I get cherry is sick. You need to tell me twice. Um, yeah, everyone is sick with the flu. And all of my Let's Plays is just a typical bathe and sing YT thing that occurs. Um, anyway, I'm just going to cut and figure out what career we're going to get them in. I'll be right back. Okay, so I've picked some careers. I think I'm going to get um, Garrett into the architecture career, which is kind of crazy. That's a crazy drop down, but I think that it's going to be really good in the long run. Um, the only other thing I'm sort of struggling with is... Actually, isn't it if if you look for the job because you've got skills and stuff, don't you get it like a higher level? Oh no, okay. I don't know. Sometimes it works, but yeah, I want to get her in the oceanography career um, because they pay quite well and they're both knowledge sims. So I think it makes sense. So I'm happy with that. Okay. So now we need to like try and get need to actually start working. So I think what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to cheat the time back because obviously we moved in. So the time's all over the place anyway. So I want to set our, uh, we'll do two. Uh, cause obviously she's got to go to work. Um, oh, actually we'll do three. All right. 3am head to work. I know that's kind of random, but I think that's what we've got to do. And in Garrett, he is going to start at 8am. So he's just going to kind of vibe for a little bit. Um, we'll go recycle that. Oh, we need to, we didn't buy any like food for Leroy. Um, that's really sad. I forgot about him. Where do I want Leroy to sleep? Actually, just, I don't really want to put him in a garage. I feel like that's horrible. Um, horrible, actually horrible. For now, we can just put him in one of the spare rooms. We need to make sure he has some food, um, a little bone. And we can't quite afford him a bed yet, but he can come sleep up on the bed with us. All right. Well, I'm just going to skip ahead until, um, we get off to work and I'll be back soon. Oh my God. I actually forgot that we brought some stuff with us from the old house. So we've got a bed already, which is amazing. And then, oh my God, we already had a big bed. Oh, well, can I sell this? Like, okay, good. Actually, yeah, we got the same amount of money 
got all our money back and we've also got um, all of our wedding stuff sorted as well, which is amazing. Um, all right, we've got a car. I forgot about the car. We could use this as a dining table. I don't know. Oh, actually, we've got a dining table, but um, yeah, we've got a few things. We've got a computer. We don't have a desk though. So actually, I've got a bit of money. Let's buy a desk. Um, where do we want to put the desk? I think he's kind of cute. We'll put it here. Stunning. Um, we'll just get a little computer chair. I always just get the same chair whenever I whenever I do this. I always just do the same thing. All right, easy. Garrett, amazing. We've got good mechanical skills, so I think we might even potentially um, look at restoring another car for Cherry um, so that she's got her own. Unless she does have her own already. Wouldn't be surprised. Oh, we have some things to sell. Okay, I'm selling this. We could keep the fish tank, actually. I honestly don't mind having a little fishy tank. We could have a barbecue. I don't know, but I kind of want to buy a cute one. So maybe we won't bother. Oh, we can put this plant somewhere nice. Let's do that. Let's put the plant there. Oh, this. Let's put that there. All right, stunning. Okay, we've got a bit more money. So exciting. All right, Cherry's heading home from work now, guys. Hopefully she's going to get promoted. Slay dolphin tank cleaner level two. Amazing. Right, so we work again tomorrow, which is fine. I'm happy. I'll cop that. Honestly, it's all good. All right, we have a nice little relaxing day at home now. Let's go watch some TV. Oh, okay. I don't know what happened there. Okay, can we just watch TV? Like, who keeps putting on a movie? Oh, hey, Cherry, you seem like a pretty insightful person. I'm developing a new product and I'd love to be interested... Wait, sorry. I'd be interested to hear your feedback on it. Here's a free sample for you to mess around with. It better be... Oh, I was going to say, it better be one of those really good TVs. But, I mean, we'll cop one of these. Or oh, can we just sell one of these and get, like, a really... Like, a, a huge TV? Oh, my God, naughty. Let's do that. Right, Slay, we're just going to watch telly for a bit. And then, oh, some visitors have arrived. Bruce Broke, Raymond and Lilith Pleasant. Slay, all right, we'll, we'll socialize with you guys today. Um, I actually don't care about your week, Bruce. No, I'm sorry. I don't know why that popped up, though. Like, why is that stuff popping up? All right, let's just go and look after ourselves. We had a big morning working as a fish chummer. Love that. Uh, let's go cook some... Oh, do I much oh 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 that's not <laughs> sorry you're just creating tiktoks um we don't have many cooking skills so let's kind of work on that all right garrett's gonna be home at three which would be awesome we've got 10 grand already yeah he's been promoted to bricklayer so you've moved off the factory floor and onto lots where actual homes are being built doing a small part to help erect structures both residential and commercial laying bricks and spreading that goop to make them stick together is only a bit tougher than mixing cement learn enough about bricks though and you might be just get to supervise other people doing it slate and supervise other people doing it what naughty sorry <laughs> still all right anyway let's continue we got a bit more money so we got 10 grand i really want to get a updated tv it's always really handy to have a nice big daddy tv is there something on the wall here? Oh, beautiful picture. Let's move it. Uh, let's move it to there. All right, let's put... Oh, we could actually get the 10 grand TV if we really wanted to. If we were really feeling a bit, um, you know, out there. Let's do it. I feel a bit out there, don't we? Oh, my God. Why is this bookcase even here? Move the bookcase into the study area. Thank you. All right, so we've got a grand. And then we're obviously doing amazing with our skills so love that for us but yeah i kind of just do i don't know do we think that maybe they'll get engaged this part and then i don't think they're gonna get married until you know we're really like got the house all settled in so do we want them to maybe go out on like a little datey poo would that be fun i don't know we'll see we're just having their first day for now cherry's just working on her cooking skill um your cooking skills fine so we love that did we i thought we cooked some, oh we were going to cook some food but cherry's shit at cooking so it's fine Oh, we're getting all our friends harassing us. Why is the phone ringing like off the hook? Like, can people just chill? All right, let's cook some food for all our f new friends. And then let's go and have a shower. Oh, actually, let's have a bubble bath. Bushy. Let's lock that down, having a baby, because we definitely want to have a baby. How's Cherry going with her cooking? Oh, we'll get it a level four, and then she can have a bit of a break. Oh, you're a bit stank, doll. Let's go. Oh, why'd you clean up that? Mm, maybe someone like half ate it. That's fine. Go and have a bubble bath, doll. Go get scrubbed up, cleaned. And then Cherry, let's just get you to level four. Amazing. All right, grab some leftovers out. Oh, babe, she's still got the flu. No, for real, this phone like actually needs to stop ringing. I also don't know where it is. Oh, there. I don't know why I placed that um, like that, but that's fine. All right, grab some food. What time does she work in the morning? 8 a.m., bit better than 4 a.m. Love that for her. 
All right, well, I think these guys might actually head off to bed and I'll rejoin with you guys in the morning. I'll be back soon. All right, it's the morning time. Got them up a bit early and had some brekkie, which is good. Um, and then we're heading off to work again. Easy. You're going to get promoted, which is amazing. And then I think we'll go get them to go on a little date. But I actually do have to wrap this part up pretty soon, though, because it is nearly 3 a.m. And I have to be up at 8 to go on my holiday. But I wanted to get one part out for you guys. So you had something to watch while I was away. Because I didn't get a chance to pre-film because I only just found out today about my holiday, as I mentioned. But all right. Anyway, let's have a look. Oh, yeah. Slay. Totally getting promoted. All right. I'll be back in a second. All right. They're both home from work now. I love that they work the same hours. It's a bit cute. All right. Yay. Double promotion there. Gary's been promoted to foreman level three. Finally in charge of more than just yourself. You've made foreman of the construction team. Your initiative has been noticed. Now put a little logic behind the mechanical knowledge of yours and some one might actually mistake you for an architect. Love that. And Cherry's been promoted to sea lice research research sorry research assistant you're finally out of the dolphin tank and into the fire assisting a real life medical researcher with a bona fide degree from sim city use underwater telenovela department and what a drama those sea lice are where the food chain meets the road they say and how stay the course get out of the lab every once in a while and get some exercise you'll be well on your way all right very exciting so we've got about three grand which is amazing and they're both um oh you got the day off tomorrow I hate that um but anyway i think i'm actually gonna wrap this part up here i'm sorry it's a bit shorter but as i mentioned i've just got to get some sleep but um we achieved quite a lot this part so we finally got the house kind of like adjusted the layout a little bit did what we could in terms of like furnishing um and i've made the decision for cherry and garrett to change careers so we got cherry now in the oceanography career which is very exciting and we got garrett into the architecture career um we're going to also work on cherry getting her own little car restored which is really really exciting um but in the next part i'm obviously going to keep working on their careers finishing furnishing up the house and then i want to take them on a date and get engaged be nice and fun and then i think yeah we might think about expanding the family Maybe Cherry finds out she's pregnant right before she gets married. A bit of fun, something a bit different. And then they're obviously going to tie the knot and have a nice little Newson family reunion, which would be amazing. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying. And we'll leave any comments, suggestions, or feedback down below for me as well. All right, I'll see you guys all in the next video. And I hope you just have a lovely day. Bye, everyone.